What's going on YouTube? This is Jose over at Spidey Spider Tumblr's coming back at you with another unboxing video. So on today's unboxing video, bear with me a little bit because I did purchase a lot of books from, I don't know how I'm going to do this, but there we go, from Hannah Comics. So I placed this order a while back. Um, it took them a little bit to get here. I don't know if I had maybe some other books on pre-order, but like I said, please bear with me. I'm going to try to keep the, the website or my email up here. I got a bunch of covers and I know a lot of them are going to be variants and they're going to be a lot of incentive covers, uh, story rate, very few ratios, different kind of stuff. So I kind of don't want to mess that up. So I went ahead and opened up my laptop. So again, like I said, please bear with me and we'll get through this as well as I can. Um, so I can give you guys all the information of what the books are. So we have, oh, we have peanuts. Let me pick up some of those peanuts I dropped because if I don't, my dogs will have a field day and they will eat up these little peanuts. So nicely packaged. I know they're not eBay, but I guess they sell on eBay and they got some of this eBay tape on there. Which is not too bad. Alright, we're going to go ahead and tear this up. I, I like to recycle, reuse, but I don't know if I want to deal with the hassle of trying to pull this bubble wrap off. So, uh, Okay, never mind. It wasn't too bad. Let's go ahead and just keep trying to salvage the recycle, reuse. So there we go. Bear with me, bear with me, bear with me. Then they have them. Um, I got the tape stuck. <laughs> so now they have them shrink wrapped. So this looks like it has a couple of. I'm not sure what this is. Venom number two, Marco Mastarzaro, Mastarazzo. We have use coupon code Breakfast Club to save, and this is going to be on a couple of these books: Batman 118, Captain Marvel 34, Ice Cream Man number 27, Download number one, Department of Truth number 14, Venom number two. We have a Oswald body, or regarding matter of Oswald's body number one, Star Wars, Star Wars Crimson Rain number one, Invincible's Red Sonia number five, Venom number one. Uh, Heathens number one, Hall Learn, Department of Truth number 14. So that was just a couple of things on there. So let's go ahead and see what I got in this break of books. Like I said, I ordered this a while back, kind of almost even forgot about it. We all know that could be pretty bad, but big rack of books. I just dropped bubble wrap on the floor. So let's go ahead and see if I can do this the right way. So the first book is going to be uh, this is going to be Red, Sonia, Age of Chaos, number two. So let me just see if I can find whether or not this is a special incentive. It is a... Oh, man, what did I do? Um, I don't know what I did, guys. All right, so let's try this again. So Invincible Red, Sonia, says it is a one in seven. Uh, more... Black and white FOC variant. So there we go. It actually was a one in seven. All right, next off we have a ooh, pregatory type thing, Red Sonia. Uh, <laughs> so let's go ahead and see if I can see this real quick. Oh, so. All right, so we may knock. Looks like there might be a different black and white variant. So we have a, that looks like it might be, sorry about what I said earlier, because that is the same cover. So we have Red Sonia, Age of Chaos, number two. This is the one in 35 Lou black and white FOC variant. 
And then we have the Red Sonia Age of Chaos number two, the Virgin variant. So this is the, the little pair there. So I kind of messed that up, but again, bear with me. The black and white kind of look the same. It's a little bit further a picture. So now we have a sacred six or number six. So let's see if I can find anything special here. This was working out pretty good and then I kind of just messed that up. <clears throat> so this one is going to be Sacred Six, Cover C, and the Chat Zoidius. There we go. Alright, let's go ahead and go on to the next one. This obviously is going to be a cosplay cover. That much was given. So we got Invincible Red Sonia, number one. The cosplay Virgin FOC variant, the one in 11. Really, really good condition. So, obviously I will be placing another order to, to them. I'm liking this. Like I said, it took a little bit. But, uh, again, probably some of these were pre-orders. So we have a black and white Vampirilla. So it looks like we have a Vampirilla number 19. This is a 1 in 7. Mastuzo black and white virgin FOC variant. So there we go. Next off we have a... don't know. And this is the problem with these uh, virgin variants that don't have anything on them. A lot of times you can open them up and look at the back. I prefer not to, but this is Sacred Six. Number 9, a 1 in 11 Mastabikov Virgin variant. So there we go. These are some killer covers too. So here we have another Vampirilla. Obviously another photo cosplay type. So let's go ahead and see. I have my Vampirillas down here. That kind of looks like a Vengeance of Vampirilla. Number 18, cover D, a cosplay variant. Next off, we have the Invincible Red Sonia number two. Uh, let's see, just for poo-poos and giggles to see if it's anything special. Looks like just Invincible Red Sonia number two. Cover C, Selena, or Selenia. Not spelled like the Mexican singer, but it's C-E-L-I-N-A. So there we go. Next, we have another Sacred Six, Faster Pussycat, Kill Kill. So this is number 10. Oh, the glare got me there. So got a crazy tattoo on her back. Let's see if this has anything special to the cover. And as you guys are probably seeing me do this, you guys probably know what these covers are. This is Sacred Six, number 10, cover D, and this is a main. M-A-I-N-E. So here we go. Next off, we have another Vampirilla, Crazy Virgin variant cover, Planet Earth in the background, guess they're on the moon. So let's see what this has a specialty of. Real freaky little cover there. So Vampirilla, number 21, number, uh, this is going to be a 1 in 30, Gunduz Virgin variant. So there we go, Vampirilla 21. Again, these were all cover buys, and I am not disappointed whatsoever. So next off, we have another Red Sonia, black and white. Uh, let's see what we got. Do, 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 do. Play my own little music. Uh, that kind of looks like it. So we got Red Sonia, black, white, and red. Number one, this is the 1 in 11 Lupacino Virgin Variant. Real nice cover again. So next off we have the Red Sonia, black, white, and red, number one. So apparently that's going to be the same kind of concept, but this one is going to be the... Okay, where did I go? That ain't the same one I'm seeing here, so bear with me. Aha! Red Sonia, black, white, red, and black, white, red. Number one, cover D, the cosplay. Next 
Next we have Red, the Invincible Red Sonya number two. Got a bunch of arrows firing at her. I wonder if there was a way for me to delete as I went like this. So Invincible Red Sonya number two, the one in seven. Mori black and white FLC variant. There we go. Nice little cover. Now we have another cosplay. We have Red Sonia, number 27. Uh, 27, cover E. Cosplay. That's all we have on there. Again, nice cover. Still got a good amount of books. So we got an Invincible Red Sonia, number two. This is going to be the same cover you guys seen earlier, but it was the black and white. This one is now the trade dress, and this is going to be a premium Moret FOC, and this is a FOC variant. All right, this one's got a little ding on it, but that's all right. Uh, color breaking ding at that. Eh, one little ding is not too bad, so there you go. You can kind of see it right there. But still a very nice cover, a black and white cosplay. That one looks familiar. Come on, Jose, what'd you do? Uh, Vampirilla, Vampirilla number 20, 1 in 11, cosplay, black and white, FOC virgin variant. That kind of looks like any, any... I'll put the name down here, but she was on pressable defects, I believe. If it's not the same one, then don't, don't think about what I said. <laughs> so here we go. We have another virgin variant. Obviously a Vampirilla. Nice little purple sky cover there. Where did you go? Uh, I want to say that kind of looks like it. Yeah, it's a little upside down. They have it, I guess, like... I guess this is the way the cover is, upside down. So we have Vampirilla number 20, the 1 in 30, Gunda's Virgin Variant. Then we have a nice... Uh, cosplay cover of Barbarella, I believe. Let's go ahead and wait to see if I can find it. So this is Barbarella, number one, one in 21, cosplay, FOC, Virgin Variant. So then we have only a few more books, and then we're done. So next we have another Vampirilla. This is Vampirilla number 22, the one in 15. Uh, white FOC color virgin variant. So there we go. We have a Vampirilla out in the graveyard. Vampirilla 22, the 1 in 30, Gunda's virgin variant. There we go. And we have another cosplay, Vampirilla. So let me show you guys the book as I look. For the descriptions, makes it a little bit better. Vampirilla 22, cover E, the Lorraine cosplay cover. There we go. Last but not least, we got a Red Sonia, black, white, and red. Another number two with a cosplay cover. Really nice co a cosplay cover there. I'm believing that's going to be it. Cover D, cosplay. Nice dragon kill right there. But that is going to be it for this unboxing video. That was a nice rack of books there. So let's see if I got all the books that I had. So here we go. Nice rack of books from Hannah Han Comics. So there we go. That's their logo. And I will be shouting them out on Instagram here soon. But again, if you guys can do me another favor, or if you guys can do me a big favor, Leave a comment down below. Tell me what you think about all these Vampirillas, Red Sonias, Barbarella, the different Virgin Variants, the different 1 in 7s, 1 in 35s, the different incentive covers, basically, the FOC covers. Um, tell me if you actually collect them. I know there's a lot of people that do collect the Vampirilla Red Sonia type books, um, and a lot of people don't. They just are kind of getting tired of seeing them. But just leave a comment down below. Down below tell me what you think. If you guys can do me another favor, please hit that like button. Give me a thumbs up. Subscribe if you guys haven't already subscribed. And please hit that notification bell so that you guys can get notified with any upcoming video that I'll be dropping soon. 
But until then, please everybody stay safe, stay healthy, and I will see you guys on the next one.